Fuck, hello? What happened there? The first time I actually was muted and it wasn't a troll. It like stopped recognizing my mic for some reason. And the Twitch TTS has stopped. In fact, everything has stopped. What the fuck has happened here? Did Steve... Did Streamlabs do like an update where it just fucks everything up? Does this still work? Wow. Oh, sound alerts works. Okay. Does TTS work? Hello? Nope. What the fuck? <laughs> When did they break everything? It must have happened recently, because that- It must have happened, like, over- It must have been yesterday. Ah, oh, sucks. Let me see if I can, like, very quickly fix it. Um, copy browser source. Twitch TTS. No, that's the same? Huh. Maybe they changed the way that it works then? That really fucking sucks, doesn't it? Man. Does the AI one still work? Um... AI one doesn't work either. What the fuck? 
What happened there? Man, I haven't even said what we're doing today. Sorry, I just really got like sidetracked by the fact that they've like broken everything and I don't really know how to fix it. That really fucking blurs. I mean, voice mod can go. Let's get rid of voice mod. I haven't used that in like a year and a half. This mod alive, that can go. Twitch TTS. Unless maybe we don't have... I guess I'll fix that in between. That really sucks. Um, yeah, so, to get on with the stream and to not do tech support. In fact, let me... Um, get rid of the channel points thing so nobody wastes their points on it. Get rid of this. Get rid of this. Weird. I don't know why that is, but I guess I'll fix that in between. Um, we're gonna be doing kind of like a early access day yesterday because we have... I want to play a little bit more of Hades 2 even though the video has come out and... We have already kind of beaten it, but I want to play like a little bit more of it on stream because I don't think we ever got to like the last boss. But I don't want to do that all stream. I also want to test out um, Foundry, which is an early access game that I tried a little bit of the other day. I don't know whether it will make good stream content. <laughs> Definitely is not enough there for a full stream, but I think if we split the two, then we could have like a, at least a little bit of an early access day today. The only reason we're not doing Subnautica today is because Fig, maybe even currently right now, is doing a tournament for um, Super Mario 64 speedrunning. And we couldn't do it Wednesday, so we like skipped a week, basically is what we're doing. And I'm like trying to fill some stuff in because I have already used up my demo wheel this week and I don't want to do two uh, demo wheels in a week because I feel like... <laughs> What is enough? So that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna stream Hades and then we're gonna stream Foundry is the plan. So first of all let me connect my PS5 controller. God I hate I hate today. I hate I hate that the button, the button to, like, make the controller discoverable is the same button to turn on the PS5. And if it turns on the PS5, then you can no longer make the controller discoverable. <laughs> so you have to, like, turn on your fucking TV, turn the PS5 off, then you try again. Okay, now let's do it. What a mess. It could just do with like a button on the control that you just press on it to like start um, making it discoverable on Bluetooth. Rather than it being like holding down two buttons at the same time that already do things and one of them is to power your PS5 on to from wherever it is. You know what I mean? I feel like they could really do with rethinking that design for when it comes for like the new controller. Although having said that, the PS5 controller is my favorite controller I think so far. Okay. Oh, fuck me. That's why. Looking on the wrong thing. Man, <laughs> technology is not my forte today, by the looks. Um, hopefully that has fixed it. Patch notes. Sprint is faster, dash out of many attack recovery animations, gather any resource 
point even unlock the corresponding gathering tool. I don't know what that means. Now make your dash immediate. I want to see what these things like that are blurred out are. Okay. Oh, I can click on the thing here. See if anything has changed that I guess it sounds like there might be something to do with the sprint. Yeah, so I've been playing a little bit in between. There's a lot of shit that has like happened <laughs> that I did not do on stream. Because I did say I wasn't gonna play through all of this on stream, and I don't plan to still. Um well, the main things are There's this to like skip time. So, like, all of this stuff comes more frequently. Um... There is this bit that's unlocked, which is like a fishing point. Which I think is the same as the Beth? I'm not sure. Well, you like just use it to skip time and, like, gain favor with somebody else. And then I have caught fish, but I don't really know what to do with fish. I would assume that you just bring them to the kitchen, but then that doesn't seem to be the case. And there she is. Princess. Oh, great. Got a lot of... I'm afraid she's right. Hmm. Hail to you, witch of the crossroads. What to cast? Yeah, then I have these, which stops Kronos from basically coming back alive. Every time you kill him. Press your ability for Kronos to prevent you from pausing during your confrontation. I don't know what that means. It gladdens me to see. Yes. The Titan. Farewell. Together we shall. So what do they change then? Oh yeah, there was like aspects of things that like do more... Like change the way that the weapons work and stuff. Additional types of river denizens. Take up more valuable items. So how does the familiar thing work then. Can I just use any of these at any time or I don't understand what they changed. I also figured out that I like the this staff more than the daggers. Another testament to and then there's this thing that I don't really know like what it does but I think it just makes it more like hard. But I don't really understand I swear it, Nix. I don't really understand what that does. And then these are like challenges that you can do. But again, I don't really understand why I need that either. Heading out. Oh, we got the cat of the frog. It's Finally. And the way the cat works is if you like run into it. Um then it will damage stuff. Oh shit, I didn't even see us spawn in, what the fuck? <laughs> I didn't even see that happen. Nightshade seeds. Nightshade seeds. So does that mean that I can just like use any of the tools at any point? Yeah, 
Is we backpack hero vibes? Dungeon crawler. Come on. I do like backpack hero. Also, hello, ugly. I think I played backpack hero since it like actually properly came out. I ain't ever played it in beta. Adequate. Oh, what I do that? Yes, I run into this guy. He starts attacking shit. <laughs> And then he goes back to bed. Games I found you back then? Yeah, Backpack Hero was the first game that I played on stream, I think. I'm fairly certain. Shit, let's get rid of you first. We had 10 followers. Yeah, those were the days. I think these games are kind of like the oh my god epic double up that's big these games are kind of like the um what are they called from software games where I like play them for me but they don't really do particularly well <laughs> this is my time you know yeah, that guy spawned and then immediately died oh, that's actually quite bad Get him, Cap. Um, I can't remember I gave this person a thing, but I think I did. Uh, yeah, this one. Go, Tula. I still don't really... Is there anything around here that I couldn't... Maybe interact with? I guess not. I mean, maybe they mean... Instead of it being like... You can just use all of the tools, maybe it's just whatever tool you pick is the only thing that spawns. Maybe? I'm not sure. That's oh, this guy. From there? Fucking hell. The rain from there is insane. Out of Hades 2 or just Hades in general? Ooh, that's pretty good. Sing, O oh Muse. This game is very popular right now.
There does seem to be a lot of roguelikes out at the minute, yes. And I don't know why. I realized that yesterday. Because I was trying to find demos for the demo wheel, and like most of them are roguelikes. Which is fine for me, because I love roguelikes, but still. I just thought it was weird. I don't know whether like Steam is having a. Uh, like an event on right now, but it does seem like there's a lot of them being made. Uh, 10% more damage. I think just critical chance is probably best. I really want to see like a little bit of resource that I probably wouldn't be able to interact with otherwise because I don't know how like the the game has changed. Didn't do the thing that I pressed, that's huge. I hate these enemies with a burning passion. Got double up early is just insanely strong. Do you know how to code or know someone who knows how to? I mean, there are like. I love how they all grouped up for me, that was big. There are people that make their own games in the community. A little too late. Yeah, I like a dungeon crawler because I do like backpack hero a lot. And scoop. Cost thirty less. Special deals forty damage. Ah, uh, none of those are particularly useful to us. I don't think. Might as well just save my money up. One year, 11 months. Jesus Christ. Oh, we're like really close to... Two years. a mess. Jesus. Uh, yeah, this one. Bigger number. Ooh, this one's better, I think. Though I know this is going to be the last room. Answers towards this one. Enchanted for the night. The flame pro build is insanely strong, is what I've realized. The first build that we had is the best one that we ever had. Yeah, I'll look at it for sure. Well, hey Hagati. Well. I vanquished Kronos. Now Shit. 
<laughs> it feels weird, it does. A little rusty, I'm not gonna lie. The sheep. <laughs> yeah. Flamethrower build, pretty strong. Is Kronos gonna be here? Yes. Greetings. Cut. Also, Poseidon gave you his blessing. What a prick. Um. Don't want any of that either. I saved my money up. That briny smell. Maybe it is just that, like. Oh, they also doubled up that, which is interesting. I didn't know that could happen. I guess now, yeah, you just spawn the things in that you have the tool for, maybe? I should have read the patch notes a little bit better. That's a bad spot to be doing this one. I do genuinely think that this well no the last area is probably the hardest. Tula, go for it. Oh. It's over. Another chitin. So she can do that multiple times then. She could not do that before. Go for the money, I guess. I don't want to be on this platform really anymore. Nice. Speaking of, um, it's just more beneficial for us to do this, I think, with the double up too. If you mean whatever you, so you do. Oh, that's one slice, fifty health, one boon, one mystery seed. Sure, I'll give me a boon. Have a great day. Some seeds. I have something for you on my authority. I have found that like it by far. Hello. Oh, that's way. Oh yeah, and I can just use this now. So why would I ever choose the a tool to take then. What's the benefit of me choosing a tool now? Sometimes I get a little boost from Artemis, but you just about all Olympus backs you up and direct your want a little 
Any damage you deal with a critical. I'm good. No, thank you. You're a loss. I still don't know what the notes do either. Oh, this is new. Um, why are you glaring at me like that, little one? Uh oh. Fuck. Uh oh, boss. What the fuck was that? <laughs> I have not fought that before. <laughs> A lot of rep. Cattail seeds. Went some health too. In the name of Hades. I grow strong. There was one boss that I was missing, so maybe that was it. I still don't know what the little notes mean. I forgot that that did damage over time. money. Holy sh What the fuck is this room? Jesus, this room is insane. Look upon me. Nice, thank you for the follow. Though it didn't come up in chat. I don't know what's happening with stream libs today. But thank you very much. I think Streamlabs must have changed the way that they do things because they all of my like alerts and stuff stopped working. Don't look down. Thank you very much. Okay, yeah, I did time it right then. Let us together shine this night, O Moon. I know through you. Behold my light. I like this one because it makes me invincible. In the name of Hades. Uh This one, I guess. Sure, I have the money, I'll buy that too, I guess. 
This one's gonna be pretty hard without a good cast, I'm not gonna lie. Shit, I got in nuts! What the fuck? They're going absolutely insane. Literally nowhere there where I would be safe. They're actually going fucking nuts. What? Did they like increase the rate in which they attack in the patch? They're going like insano style. <laughs> Actually going fucking nuts. And that bit bugged out too. Streamviewers.org. Oh, it's a bot. That makes sense. Enjoy the bad book. They must have changed the way that that boss works, because that was absolutely fucking nuts. Or something got changed. Because it was not that hard before. Actually, well, I should not have that much health missed. Too far my ground. Look for the markers. And the sprint does seem faster now I like actually think about it. Yeah, no need to engage. Ooh. Also, to say I have like an epic double up, I've dub I've seen double up like twice. I also think that like whatever the boon is where it's like if you stack up so much scorch and then they do like a percentage damage I think he's a trip because like the I'm just never gonna get that much scorch that just isn't gonna happen No 
Also, this guy's bugged out. <laughs> Loves his gold. Got double up on the gold. Okay, if this is the Queen Lamia, then this is fine. If this is the other one, then we're sort of fucked, but I'm gonna roll the dice. Guess the other one we're fucked. Yep. Well. Gonna do the blow. Just think our build is not as good as it could be. I think Scorch is a trap. I'm not gonna lie. Getting warmer. <laughs> I think I've been sold a ruse here. I think it's almost always better just to do damage. Just because I can. Can't right now. Hello, gigantic severed head. <laughs> gigantic severed head. Yeah, that's what I wanted. Can't take this yet. like a really bad time. Hello. He's just that help. You see what I mean? Like the damage over time doesn't really work. Oh, hello. It doesn't really work in a game that's supposed to be so fast-paced, because you're not like, what am I going to do, just like sit around and wait? Oh <laughs> I don't mean. I think it's not built to be that type of game. See what I mean? Like that's just never gonna happen. Strength of the gods. Should be able to revive that bow. I'm good. I have a lot of money though. Should help. Me that one too. Is there another option or just this one? Just looks like this one. Okay. <laughs> Sure. I don't know whether like one encounter in here means like one of these or whether it means like a room. Shades there. Because if it is a room, it's kind of fucked. Oh, I 
light bulb, I think, on the wrong bit. Oh, but I've come to the... This was a mistake. I cornered myself. It's just taking me too long to kill these guys, so they're just stacking up so many, like, mines and shit. This run is so... it's so Jova. <laughs> Game makes life. I just don't think. <laughs> I am just gonna kill myself. Start again. Ah, actually, you know what? Let me see. Oh, my controller for is there for a sec. Let me see if there's anything to like pick up in this room. I guess. Or I guess it would be beneficial to try and finish this room so I can buy stuff. Holy shit, did not see those guys down there. See what I mean? Like, I'm just not doing enough damage at this stage in the game. What was the other one? Money? Still with that guy. Uh, I should go for this. Hey, mate, you're gonna suck me in now, don't you, son of a bitch? <laughs> And we're also going for the double up on it. Um, wasn't it like down here? The other one? Yeah, here we go. Incoming. I held down square there and nothing happened. What the fuck? Or X even, sorry. Oh my god, we got so much money. Oh, that is sad. There's a shop here. Is there a well up here? Did we see a well in this one? Oh no, I can't remember. I think it was the last one. Fishing point there. It's a little sobby. Oh man, there's nothing to buy here that's like good. Wheat seeds. Which means the next good shop is gonna be. So oh, I like the end of the next one. Specials are faster for sure. Um, I don't need any healing. I probably should have gone for the armor then. Because going into Cerberus with no death defies is pretty bad. I'll break you from your shell. Especially when you accidentally press X at the wrong time. Oh, 
back at me. What are you talking about? around him would live. <laughs> oh, this comes out so quick. Probably worst case scenario too in terms of spawn. Didn't have enough mana for that. That's big. Help me care to The range is always so big on it. Well, this sucks, doesn't it? Oh, I had a depth of fire from somewhere. I'm just not doing stuff quick enough. And that's partly because of the Scorch. Because the Scorch... Inherently means that you have to just like fucking wait around for them to die basically And that just does not work in this game Do you like I'm giving him all this time to do all this shit That I can't dodge It just doesn't work I think yeah, like, almost always better off going for, like, Poseidon or somebody else that just gives you, like, flat damage. I didn't do all the bosses. Oh, they got all the Witcher Staff stuff, too. Not that any of this helps, but... I still need to find the three fates, which I don't really know how to do. Maybe I should look that up. The shipment's arrived. The shipment. Let's lock it up, shall we? That'd be kind of cool to do on stream. How to find the three fates in Hades 3. Three? <laughs> Two. Uh, maybe it's not in the game yet. Uh, yeah, it doesn't look like it's in the game yet. Which makes sense because the things that you get as a reward by the looks are the things that you need to, like, finish the game. So, I guess that kind of makes sense. Nevertheless, 
You have every. Our wards are the first. Must be an incantation that can help. I can almost guarantee you there isn't. Um. I need these ones, really. I don't need Molly for those, it doesn't really make that much of a difference. Those sand I do. Tis merely. I once Perhaps. Oh, she's a menace. Did the gods answer your call at least? <laughs> for the most part. Come along. Boop. 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 Yeah, I don't know why you would God not. Flourishes. Like, why you would ever change the tool, then, if you can just use all the tools without taking any of the tools? If that makes any sense. Unless, like, you get more... ...stuff from gathering with a tool that you take, rather than you using it with your hands. I don't know. I, I genuinely don't know, like, what the... ...the point of that is. Special Bless Restore 5. It's another one that I have on at the minute. How do I know? How can I tell? No. How do I turn the thing on? Momus. I need more than I have. I need nightmares for that. Yeah, but that's only rank two though. How do I how do I change them? Ah oh, fuck it, who cares? <laughs> we'll do one more run, then we'll swap over to Foundry and see what Foundry's like. Ready or not, hence I go. For my family. More scorch. I'm just going to go for the ones that don't actually do Scorch. Good. Because I think it's a trap. I think it's a trap. Um, more health, I think, is more beneficial to us right now. Get him, cat. Stay where you are. me. Tula, be my guest. I guess Tula's the best pet to have because the... That's a bite. I got a mofa. Well, I guess the, like, the ghost things are skill-based, but... Most of, like, the gathering things are just, like... Next. You just press a button and then you gather them, like that. So I guess having a pet that can, like, do all of them without fail every time is insanely strong. Oh, one of them did actually make it that way. I thought I'd tricked all of them. Hey, take this tree. Oh, 
Um. I'm grateful, Daedalus. Oh man. Seem to be out of the point where we're only getting one boss for this area, though, which is kind of nice, I guess. Get him, cat. on that is insane. It's like the entire arena. What the fuck? Tax deal more damage in a larger area. This one. Okay, so now we're getting this guy. That's a good sign. Because that guy's usually good for casts and stuff. What the fucking chances are that? Twice in a row. Count right now. Some more health back. You seem just <sighs> same to when? Um Of these really? Oh, I should have done another shipment. What am I doing? This one. Fuck. This one. This one. This one. Nailed it. First try. Um, this one's probably best. Nice, back up to full health. And I really underestimated how powerful that restore health one is. Right hand, welcome back. <laughs> oh, this is a bad swap the bin. Bam. I bid you shine for I have something for you. I saw the uh, that one's also not dead. Give me the fish. We're actually getting a lot of ways to like regain health, which I'm not used to, and I'm definitely gonna forget a bit. This is why the cast is so effective. I like right now, if we're in a boss, I could be casting and then doing other things. But it's just so effective just to like plop it down while you're doing other things, you know? Almost our anniversary it is. I still can't believe it's that long. It's actually kind of insane. See what I mean? Like, it just absolutely nuked that guy. <laughs> 
And not only that, but anything in it is just automatically slowed anyway. Get him, Cap. Let me slay a foe. Uh. Sure, I'll go for that one, I guess. Oh, do I think this is the last room? Yes, fuck. I should have gone for the. Well, actually, Into the purse. it is better for me to do this. Ooh, this was pretty good. Doesn't mean we're gonna be actually absolutely fucking burning Desira. through our mana though. Strength. Thank you, Ed. Good. Take one of these. Actually I don't know if this one was a good pick, because my thing already did two hundred. I'm less confident in my choice now. Triple divide. Boundary is another early access game that I wanted to try, which we're going to do after this run. But it's basically like a survival game, I think. Yeah, I definitely shouldn't have taken this power. And it was for sure a mistake. Because <laughs> my thing, I mean, it detonates immediately, I guess. Oh, it's absolutely rinsing through our mana. on one health, fuck you. Huh? It's absolutely fucking dumb. It's like rinsing through all. Uh... Mana. I don't know how good this will be late game. Probably not great. Did it hit us though? Go on. Return to shadow now. And I fulfill a prophecy, whatever that means. I don't know what prophecy that was. I'll take the health, I guess. I have to talk to Cronus. I'm gonna save my money. Nothing to grab in here for the first time. I also don't know why I'm, like, occasionally doing 600. Oh, 
I got it almost completely blacked out there. I think my Scorch isn't going to be much better though. I mean, it's not bad, but the thing is, it just does the same thing that my other one did. Except now it doesn't slow because it's not like there the whole time, you know. Enough of this. Rapidly restore, but you have twenty percent max life. Yes. Even though I don't want to take less life. No escape. It's a I kind of need the mana region. Um, I'm going to take this one because I think Poseidon's going to be the easiest one to deal with. Send in your casts. Which one am I getting rid of? I doesn't really do anything for us either because we're not going to be standing in it for very long. I'm going to do this one, I think. Sorry, Poseidon. I'm sorry, Uncle Poseidon. He wants a fight, does he? Sometimes, like, the character just freezes. And it's terrifying every time. Fuck. Shouldn't have gone for that. Greedy. Specials hit foes. Yep, that's what I wanted. A wave of power. <laughs> um, actually, I don't know what Apollo could give us now that would be good for the build. But increasing our uh, stuff from Poseidon probably would be good. Son of a bitch every time. Oh, I don't think the cat can attack <laughs> on this one. I should not have done it. Uh oh, it's a bit. Mine of finds. Oh, none of these are good for what we need, really. I guess attacks having splash on it isn't the worst thing in the world. Just stay out of my way. Showed up just as I was about. Finally. Oh man. I hate this one. 
My belt isn't built for this. successfully uh, secured the victory here. Oh, I have one armor left. To you again. Thankfully there is a... Oh, I can't do this until there's a thing down here. Say, how do you get past Just answer. Okay. Later. She chose that one, that's fine. I do have gold to spare. Can I steal 35% damage? Yep, we'll take that. Oh, I didn't know that gets you the... I mean, I guess that makes sense. Gets you the cards. Um, I don't really care about making the... thing better. The Selena thing better. So I guess I'll go for that one. That's fucked up that he didn't get... Stunlocked when I broke his armor? What the fuck was that? Too hot for you. I guess if they start their attack before they get broken, then they can push through. That's better. Bigger thing. Again, the like controller keeps sticking for some reason. What do I need? Uh, probably this. Actually, need is a strong word. I'm gonna do this too. Oh, I didn't kill. Oh, okay. For five, I thought that was gonna be it, not gonna lie. <laughs> the controller keeps sticking. Why like right there? See, look, what's happening there? I think my stick drift is getting to the point where I can't play. And I held down square there to try and get some health back, but I guess that wasn't gonna work either. <sighs> Definitely wanna shop. <laughs> Although the mana is tempting. I should buy it here though. Dodge any damage? 20% dodge chance, holy shit. Absolutely that one. It's like insanely high. Okay, so casts are generally good against the bosses. The only problem is the casts are good because usually they do damage over time, whereas this one does, does damage instantly, so... I don't know how good this is gonna be. But I guess we'll find out. Let's not do a lot of damage. Stop freezing, please. It's already hard enough. I don't want to fucking fight my controller, too.
Oh, they broke. She got so much health, the fuck? There we go. Oh! Okay! <laughs> Did not know it had that much tracking on it. That's honestly my bad. Let's heal. Shit, I'm out. That's not good. I was gonna say hello, <laughs> but I wasn't doing any damage that bit. At the very least, that song is a banger. Sing about that. There. And then we'll heal. And then... I've never used this before, but I'm assuming this gets reset now? Yes. I mean, I guess we would have healed there too, but... I don't want any of it. The yeah, they're like freezing. So I think what ha what is happening is the like... Path the stick drift is pushing it in one direction, so when I hold down X to do the cast, it's like locking in this position. And then when I come out of the cast, it doesn't know what to do, so it just keeps pushing me in that that direction, which is not the best. But it is what it is. A path of golden petals shall guide you. Okay, these fucking rolling heads. See what I mean? Like, it's so weird. When I come out of that cast, she just starts running in one direction. I don't know why I'm attacking this guy. I just really don't want to buy a new controller. There's so much money. Money, I guess. What is he in? Like a? I think that guy was outside of the map. Some of these golden coins. Oh, it's only twenty coins. This will be more though, right? Four life. I feel like those were more. <laughs> well, like what I just got wasn't a lot. He's leaving, okay. Come on. That's that sucks. Like to hold down square. That blows. Actually blows. Yeah. 
into barriers. Sure. I think I'm finished here. Two bosses, huh? Please be the. It's always this one. Try and take my blood. Hopefully I can deal with the ants pretty effectively right now. But he has so much health and he's so quick. Please. Fuck. Oh, I hate this boss so much. Either. Where do you even go? Jesus. No blood where you I think go. by far the worst. In the name of Hades. Like minibus. Double up is pretty good. <laughs> I'm going. Step aside. Do this one because then we can maybe echo uh, Poseidon Boon. He's sorry. Narcissus, I mean. Think he's sorry? He had no idea what happened to you. But he re He only loves himself. Yeah, this one. Be strong, okay? Be strong. Be strong. Be strong. Oh, yeah, more mechs life. Finally, so that kind of offsets the negative mechs life thing we got. Um... I think unfortunately it has to be this one, even though the other two aren't great, but I just need the mana. More corrupted. I'm getting to the point where, like, I'm... Because we're using 15 every time. We do a blast. Man, Cerberus is going to be fucking impossible with this build. I've only just now realized. And with this shit going on too. I like the controller being weird and floaty. It's going to be miserable. Oh god, this guy. Does it have a max range? Doesn't look like it, does it? <laughs> so like, I'm holding down X the entire time there. I don't know where the scorch came from. Where was I? Plus one time before the fountain. Gain fifteen gold. You still have uses left. In serenity. 
impervious. I mean, impervious is very good. Sure, we'll go up that way. Oh, and a double up. <laughs> Huge. Okay, we can get the impervious. Um... I guess I'm probably not gonna get over that way. So I'm gonna do this, and then I'm gonna do this, I guess. I can also hear another head. Get some health back. Don't wanna aggro those guys. What was that mana one it? Because that was the one that I came in for <laughs> and I have not seen yet. It must be like down? I don't know if I can go any more down though. It must be down here. Why oh, you want that? Get back up to full health. Um more of those. Oh! <laughs> double up again. Fuck, I should have gone for down here then now. And that seemed to be some lag, and I don't know where that's coming from. It's very weird. I thought it was, like, the thumbstick, but it... This looks like everything now. Yeah, not being able to slow everybody in here is a real problem. Oh, he missed? Fuck. See, now we're out of mana again now. Could do with refilling my health. That's yeah, perfect for it. It's cleared up. Maybe a double up? Fuck, that's where we really needed the double up. Damn. That's unfortunate. I mean, a double up on the other things is good, but... Take damage, restore some health. You deal more damage until you take damage. I guess I'll go for this one. I can get out now. Um, since we're using the cast, I don't think this will help us that much. And we have a lot of money, so I think the shop is probably the best bit. We've healed up to full health. Grab this flower. Oh, there's a hammer hit on by anyway. Attacks and specials are stronger, that doesn't really help. This 
strength of the sea. Yes. Those are our best bang for buck, I think. With the double up. Um this one I guess. I don't know how this will do against this boss, so I'm not gonna lie, I don't think probably very well. You're all mired up again. Especially when it doesn't let me do the this. Oh I'm not <laughs> The damage at the top doesn't look great. I don't have a great amount of confidence in this. Oh, that still hit? What the fuck? If I could get close to him to attack him, that would be huge. Easy now. Hey, this is new. What the fuck am I supposed to do here? This build's good for this. Probably should have taken the the Opta special. This is just taking way too long. Help me, cat. Hawk. Keep fucking back it off. Oh, because I'm dropping dupes on them. That's probably it. <laughs> That's probably it. Now I think about it. This is not going great. Let's 
gonna say, what am I supposed to do there? He stops doing this. Oh, damn it, when I press the button, please. This is hard enough for them to try and fight my controller too. Damn, this build is miserable. Even the boss knows what to do. It's like, how has this gone on for so long? Fuck. Thank God for that. Jesus. Poppy. Yeah, I don't think. <laughs> I think the casts are like by far the best option in this game for like damage. But I do think that a lot of them are, are pretty trash. Did I lose any health on that? No. Let's take less damage, I guess, would probably be good, because this specific level of the game is insanely hard. Kronos awaits. Good luck down here. Did Kronos build all this? It worked. There's no way this is gonna work on the final boss. I'd be very surprised if this even works here, to be honest. Remember when I said this is the hardest level in the game? I meant it. He said hello! Help me, Cat.
This area is so hard. No traitor to the house shall go unpunished. Jesus. I've never seen those before. Oh, the rats! I've never seen that before. Help me, can't. Yeah, that's what I was hoping for. I didn't see this will be played before. It's Hades himself and the dog. The resting hound of hell. Can I pet him yet? Some other time. I'm not Zagreus, I guess. Such a cacophony occurred after you last visited. Perhaps they were concerned. Blood and darkness. <laughs> not on my own at all. I had their strength, if not their support. As you've given me your... You shall seek vengeance with a renewed zeal. But, uh... Uh... Cast lots of projectile dead ahead. Indeed. Made me of use. Oh, yeah. That might be better. I guess. For our family. Went through him. What? Hit him, cat. More coming. When I hold down X, I wish it would do the thing that does hold down X. Because <laughs> sometimes I hold down X and it's like, oh shit, that means you want me to do something. I actually don't know whether this was a good idea or not. I'm sorry to think probably not. I don't know what happened, but it's way buggier now after the patch than it was before. I don't want to do a boss, because I think we've seen all the bosses. And it serves as nothing other than to kick the shit out of me before we get to the actual boss.
Where is this rat? It's funny because you start the game in Hades 1 in this bit. And then you work your way up and in this one it's the other way around. That's a really bad spot to be in. Jesus. Fuck. You just don't see them. I was gonna say, surely there's gotta be. Nice, at least we get to see the final boss. I don't think I ever did this on stream. Um. Okay, I definitely wanna buy this. And I definitely wanna buy this. Take that. I'll take that just to heal up to full, even though I feel like it's kind of a waste of money, but there's nothing else to spend it on now. Quick this is gonna be garbage against this boss, because it's been garbage against every boss. Uh, at last. But at least you get to see the boss. The course of history is mine to shape. Yet you, you don't set the course. I do in fact take it. Oh, come on, they weren't loaded in yet. That's fucked up. Man. I'm gonna lie, this is kind of unplayable. <laughs> like, it's definitely getting there. It's like, there's a good, like there, there's a good, like, half a second where, like, no inputs do anything, like, right there. my foe, I want it to go into this. Help me, cat. Your legions of the golden age are dead, my guy. Oh, no, no. Help me, cat. 
I missed. Okay, what the fuck was that? <laughs> and that 20% miss rate is coming flush, I'm not gonna lie. in the follow -up. means I have more guests I wish for you to meet. We can't. Oh my god, that the tracking is cocking me here. Oh my god, we're going to the second phase. Child. Like father, like daughter, then is it? That heal really <laughs> carried me through there. I'm not gonna lie. I don't really understand this phase though, because I get hit like it immediately takes a depth of fire. <laughs> down X, but like, I'm just not doing anything. 
couple of those. Tracking is cocking me, brother. It's like tracking too many things at once, so it it's like not hitting anything. That's fucked up. means We got him. I always hate Fuck you, Critus! With a shit build too. This I shall not. Easy game, baby baby forget. game for babies. For my brother. For oh, my brother, hell yeah. I didn't actually touch this last time, I just went straight into the thing because I didn't know which one was going to be which. The remains of time. Should have a look around. Oh. Okay. Vanquished <laughs> only for the moment. I thought it was going to be a thing, but I guess not. Wow, I really did not think we were going to get him that time. I guess the heal is like insanely OP. I know he's going to give us some spiel and then we'll die again. Back to shadow, she returns for now. We shall resume her tale at another time. I did not know Return to shadow now. that the like heal was so strong. It carried us through the first phase. Congratulations, you have Anchorage Kronos. And I don't actually think we can do anything other than that in this game. Not a bad no. night, I guess. Because there's only two levels of the, the like upstairs, the surface world that is done. Everything else, you just die and then you come back because they've not finished doing that bit yet. And I don't think you can Good evening, actually everyone. physically beat the game yet because there's no ending to the game. They have not added it yet, so. His own well, oh, totally. <laughs> I fear I'm not at liberty to do such things. <laughs> Okay, it's just some random Stay shit playing about. You know how come I'm really back? Don't I won't let you What would you even know? Hmm. I accept this gift. Good work. Nice. Yeah, that's pretty much all we can do. Come here to go. I wasn't Yeah. Then you can do the I heard you. That's what I Chronos. Did you not? Well, yes. I always did. Okay. Guess we'll swap over to Foundry and see what that's like. Oh, I just sent the cat to hit that guy. My bad. Sorry. Nice. So we have, like, officially beaten the game then now, I guess. We can buy, like, some more stuff. Sorry, I keep running into stuff, bud, and I'm really fucking you up. But I don't really think that's... There's not a lot there to do really on stream. 
And then I guess we'll just keep our eye on whether or not there's going to be a new update. Because we need, like, some send to, I think, beat the game, if they keep it that way, I guess. And we have two sends right now, so hopefully that should be enough to, like, when we come back in to finish the game. So now, we're going to swap over to a different game. And we're going to play Foundry, which is... I played a little bit of it the other day, and it seems pretty good, but I don't know if there's more to it than what I, I saw. So, we're going to see together. I'm going to start a new world. I think it's, from what I can tell, procedurally generated, you, like, get dropped into a world and then you have to, like, make stuff to survive on that world. But you can make, like, factories and stuff, and it's, like, a little bit, like, satisfactory meets... Planet Crafter, I guess, in a way? Because I played Planet Crafter pretty recently, and I've got to the end of that game in Early Access. But yeah, you can build all this ship. You get a like, cute little robot down here. Actually, while all this is loading in, I'm going to fix my kin. Um, I did turn sound off because I was editing while I was testing it out. We'll go here, I guess. World name... Moon's... Smile. Six nine six nine. What's was seed six nine six nine six nine six nine six nine six Let's do that. So it's procedurally generated. You get dropped in. Welcome operator. I'm this is Carl, our world. your facility management artificial intelligence. This resource-rich moon has been selected for the Foundry Initiative with the goal of converting it into a manufacturing hub. Construction work has already started and many teams, just like us, have been deployed with their initial assignments. Our task is to establish mining and smelting operations to ensure a steady supply of essential metals. My goal is to assist you in setting up this factory. Let's run a few basic checks before we get started. Open your map to check your surroundings. Sorry, Carl, but I'm gonna do my own thing, but... I get a little too loud. So from what I can tell... There are like three... Well, from the time that I played, there were like three ores. There's this one, then there's this one. And then we can get these smelting. Where was the other one? Wait, over here. I guess let's check on that to make Fantastic. call like us again. There are several ore patches in the vicinity. Equip your ore scanner from the inventory and use it to locate the ore patches. To get started, approach both of the ore patches and mine some ore. <laughs> I'm already there, buddy. <laughs> now that we have an initial supply of ore, 
we need to smelt it into plates and rods. Go back to your drop pod and use the built-in smelters to create your first crafting materials. This is multiplayer too, but I feel like the problem is... Sorry, it's going to be less loud when I'm not fucking using a jack hammer right next to the mic. I feel like the problem with these types of games, and I had the same problem with Planet Crafter too. Well, like, there's not really much else other than, like, once you've got everything set up and automated, there's, like, no end game. There's, like, no reason to, like, go exploring or anything, or it's, like, quite a small world. But I don't know if that's going to be the same with this game. Now that we have basic materials available, we should start crafting building blocks which act as a foundation for other buildings. To do so, you, you need to blocks. open the crafting more menu shit and them. click the desired items. Then, place them in the shape of a platform next to one of the ore patches. Uh, where were the ore patches again? Hey, here we go. They probably want them, like, connecting in between, right? That would make sense. Boom. Yeah, because they're, like, this way and this way. Okie dokie, so we take this. So we want... How many do they want me to place? 30 building blocks as foundation. Um... Okay, so... Oh god, I need to think about, like, how this is gonna look. Smelters, I think, are 2x2. Two then you need another two coming out of either side. So that's six par, so we need twelve, then maybe thirteen for the one in the middle. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. So just like that to for automate or extraction, we need to set up a drone miner. Craft one and place it on top of your foundation, right next to the ore patch. Drone miner. Let's make two. Might have been a mistake, but it is what it is. Actually, I could do with some more. More building blocks. Because I think. Okay, we have two drone miners. Yeah, these are. The correct ones. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. So we need six. One, two, three, four, five, six, and then this is the middle. Actually, maybe we should do one more on each side. Just so like this is central. Four. Drone miners and That's most other central. buildings require power to function. Let's build a biomass one, two, generator three, four, five, on the six. same foundation as the drone miner. Once built, you need to harvest some plants and trees with your mining drill to collect biomass. Insert the biomass into the generator and it will start to power all buildings on the same foundation as the generator. 
Okay, cool. God, I need so much more sh is. Uh oh, I'm what out? Okay, I need to be more wary then, I guess. I can't be like setting stuff up for late game. So we're building a thingamabob now. I guess let's pop that on here. And then. Go the watch your mining drones acquire your first automated ore. Aren't they beautiful? Anyway, so beautiful. We need to get going. Let's build a smelter next. Look at him go! So I think plan is we'll just have like a long strip. And then a long strip, I think, is the best plan. And then they'll get like smelted along this line and then they'll all meet in the middle into like a big storage bit. I think is the best way to do it. Also what fucks me up about this game is that... <sighs> you would think like... <laughs> F is usually flashlight but F is demolish and L is flashlight. And then C and B are like bank to bank where I thought they would be. I always have to, like, look down at my keyboard like I'm an old man. Which I am an old man, but still. You know what I mean. Alright, let's just put one on the foundation so they can stop the smelter is more yelling at me. ...than the inbuilt drop pod smelter, so you should start using this from now on. Another benefit is that we can automate the smelters to make our life easier. For this, you need to connect the drone miner to a smelter by using loaders and conveyor belts. Yeah. Please go ahead and connect them while I'm notifying mission command on our progress. Okay. I'm just gonna do it manually for now. Failure. Curiously, I find myself unable to make contact with mission command. It could be I actually have 200. I shall persist in my attempts. What do I need to make another? God, the like electrical buzzing is so loud. Machinery parts. I just need more of these. Yeah, there we go. It's not gonna look pretty right now, all right. But it will. I promise. Oh, I do actually have 20. Yeah, you know what, sure, let's set this up, I guess, while we can. So the ending is, like, here. And then the other ending is like yeah. Pop, pop, pop. Okay, nice. No, uh, <laughs> sure, that'll do, I guess, for now. Cut down some trees, I guess. 
do like these types of games a lot. The only like time I can play Minecraft for such a long time is if I'm playing a mod pack that is basically this. Like the Sky Factory things. You know? I can never just like sit down and play normal Minecraft, but I like the things where I can like automate everything and make like big machines and stuff. Okay, so now it wants me to do the loaders. Um. There's so many things that I want to build. Did I leave everything in here? Oh no. No. I've never actually been up into this drop wood. Oh! Customized character. Make it yellow. Not that anybody will see. <laughs> the drill is yellow now. I did not know that was a thing. That's kind of cool. So burners are going. Got 200 of this. I would like to make more of these, but I think I need the rods for this. Two. I think two is pretty good. Okay, so I'll turn down sound effects volume. So if we need two. And I think this is... Equal. 2, 3, 4, 5. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Yes. Okay. Pop this back down for now. Just so we can keep getting these. And then again, let's do this. Nice, stream streak, hell yeah. You'll love to see it. Flashlight, learn about the flashlight. I'm good. <laughs> but thank you. Much appreciated. So, again, we want five on either side. So let's make these up this way. And then this should be... Yes, it is. Okay, so that will do for now. So now... Why do we need so much crap? Hmm, so we could have... God, I need so much resources. I wonder if it was probably better to do more smelteries, just so we can start smelting some shit quicker, you know? I think I fucked up. But we can have loaders, and then these. So my plan is, right, we do... Like here, and then here.
And then... Oh boy, I need so much. Well, my plan is we do like this, and then like this. And then we got like rubble coming out. And then like this, and then like this. And then... Just make more foundries for now. Just so we can like plan some shit out, you know? Because I feel like this will benefit us in the long term. I don't know how fun this is to watch, but I'm having a blast. Okay, so then my plan is... We can come out three, that's probably fine. So my plan is then we have smeltery. Okay, so we probably need... I don't know if this will work, but I'll give it a try. It does. So then... We have it like here, say. And then intake, yes. So then that's going straight into there, and then obviously we have another one on this side. And then eventually, the reason I've given so much room this way is we'll have, like, outputs this way. Now, actually, I wonder if the outputs would be better in the middle. So now we're getting inputs into here. Grab all of this crap out of here. Make another one of these, another one of these, a couple of these. So how many did I come out by? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. By five. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two. Okay. And you can buy another three. then eventually when we connect these in the middle, they'll all be using the same power anyway, so we won't have to have two furnaces up. Okay, so that should be the same amount. And we have... Did we have these in the middle? Yeah, we did. So these in the middle. And then... Boop, 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 boop. I want it to be symmetrical. So these only come out by one before they're... eaten. Um, so let's grab these. Are these right on the edge? They're not, right? No. They're here. And here. And then... Right, because then they only come out by one. That's going automatically in there. Need one more loader. I think it's 
I can't remember if they said four or eight smelteries to max out a drone thing. I'm not sure. So let's just pump all of that into there just so we can start maybe linking this up. Input, nice. But I don't need output for now. Well, let's just start getting some of this down, maybe. Boop, boop. Boop. So now we got triple. Triple production of this. Um, need more loaders. And we need more conveys. And we need more building blocks. <laughs> we need more of everything, pretty much. So this will be like this. You have the machines necessary to connect the drone miner to the smelter. Now, attach a loader to each machine and connect them with conveyor belts. Already done it, bud. After you are done, you should build more smelters and have them produce enough metal plates and rods to fulfill our mission. Speaking of which, the mission control link remains non-responsive. Our objective is near completion and immediate guidance from mission command is required. We have completed our initial mission of setting up a smelting facility. We've done a great job, haven't we? We have. At we. this point, we should have received further instructions, but something is blocking our communications. I, mean, I we. think we'll have to improvise. My archives contain a blueprint for a research server. Through material analysis, I should be able to provide an emergency beacon blueprint. Let's get going and build a research server. I'm good. <laughs> I want to set this up first before I do anything else, because I feel like this is probably going to benefit us a lot. The research server, that's pretty much where I played up to. And it unlocks, like, the rest of the game, pretty much. But it will unlock, like, storage that we can actually pump into. But we're obviously not there yet. We're not getting, like, far off, though. Look at this. Like, I think what we have so far is working pretty well. Wait for the smeltery to be done. I actually think this game works quite well for early access. The only thing, as I say, is that I don't know if... I don't know what the end game looks like. Like, this is all very satisfying, but I don't know whether, like, this is it, you know? Because sometimes it is. And that kind of... that kind of sucks, if it is. Okay, I should really stop now because I... At some point... I guess we do want to do eight, so that would be... Two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve... I don't know if we'll have enough. We could do four. And then we just see where we're at with four. Might be the way. Well, this is, as you can see, very satisfying. I don't know if it's very, like, fun to watch. There's a lot of, like, waiting around and shit. But it is, like, very satisfying to do. Oh. I don't think got on with a... Tournament. Oh yeah, we can make so much shit now. 
Okay, let's be smart about this then. We definitely want two more of these. Definitely want to put this loader on because this is going to waste. So... Let's do five of those. Let's do six of these, actually, because then we can see how far it will come out, I guess. It looks like there'll be enough space, but I'm just not sure. Because if we have... we can probably work it out, actually. Two, four, six, eight. So that needs to come out another 16, right? No, it needs to come out 16 total. Two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve, fourteen, sixteen. And then two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve, fourteen, sixteen, eighteen. Did I do eighteen on here? Two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve, fourteen, sixteen, eighteen. 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16. Oh, it is only sixteen. What am I doing? So this is actually the correct amount then. Spread, thank you for the follow. Again, the notifications are fucked up, but... Okay. So if it's only going to come out this much, then... Maybe it was better to do it from the outside in. Is it too late to redo it all? Because <laughs> I kind of want to. And I also don't think we need... I think we only need two on each side. I think I might do it from the outside in so that when it finishes it's on the inside. You know? So let's do that. I mean, all of this did need to stay here anyway, to be fair. And then we'll do like this. And then like this. And then we'll do along the outside like this. I think it's probably best. We are using more conveyors. Well, we should have like a shit ton of stuff to grab from here now. I think this is the right call. Because if we want these to meet in the middle, and we want like a, a storage area. Do 20 of each of those. I think that should be fine. And it makes sense for them to be that way. Did I put these? I do want them to still be symmetrical though. Yes. might seem like quite a big area, but it will make sense, I promise.
Nice. So now we have enough building blocks so we can stop building that. Um, let's sort these out while they're here. Since we need to wait for more shit to be built anyway. I do find these games like... These are the types of games and it's the same in like... Tech it and stuff too. Or like Sky Factory that I was talking about in Minecraft where you just like blink. And then it's night time and all the fucking day is gone and you don't know. <laughs> you're like where the entire fucking... Time is gone. Okay, so did I do these? Yes. Not that it matters really, but I want it to be symmetrical because of my mental illness, <laughs> basically. So then we can do boop, 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 boop. Boop, 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 boop. And we've run out of power by the looks on this one. We will eventually be able to stop cutting down trees. Holy shit, look at these trees over here. These should give like a lot of biomass, surely. Thirty-eight. Tropical rainforest seed. Oh, it's so pretty in there. I'm gonna stop cutting it down, actually, because I feel kind of bad. Get these. Okay, so these should be going now, which they are. I need more loaders. Yeah, you've run out of power too. And we're really burning through power, which does make sense when you look at what the fuck is happening. <laughs> Whoops. I think they said eight. Maxes it out. I could have probably shunted these a little bit further along. But I don't think having, like, room to move is the worst thing in the world. How many loaders do we actually need? So we need six. So we take two off of that, so that's four. And then another six, so ten. And another six, so sixteen. And then another six, so twenty-two. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two. Um, I do need more of these, but I will also make more of those. So now we should have enough loaders for everything. I mean, all the ones that we have, I guess, right now. We need better power. Which also comes from the research thing. I tried to automate the research thing when I had like a quick playthrough with it and it just was not worth. Oops. It just truly was not worth the, the hassle. I thought I put a weird one down somewhere. Um, okay, so we have enough for that. We have enough for that. 
How much biomass do I actually have? Quite a lot. These should all be... Oh, I didn't connect them up with this. Nice. So now all these are making stuff too. Oops. Red power is strained, yeah. <laughs> I wonder why. I'm probably gonna start looking at doing this now, actually. That's the only way we're gonna be able to, like, get to a point where... So this needs to be four long. Oh, because we're building the other stuff. That's right. I would just like a little bit of a base of operations that's not going to get, like, bogged down by this, you know? Boop, boop, boop. Boop, 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 boop. Another one? Um, I did build the thing, didn't I? Oh, yes, here. Yeah. Okay, do we have a middle to this? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen. Okay, so nine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Those two should be the middle. Probably only gonna build it out to like here. Mad at a game, so I'm back. <laughs> Welcome back. Oh, this is three by three. That's really annoying, isn't it? To advance in research, you will need to build science packs. Craft a few by hand and insert them into the research server to research the emergency beacon blueprint. Yeah, the emergency beacon is what I want to do. Surely. It's honestly really annoying that that's three by three. <laughs> Ugh. I mean, I guess I can put these things here now. But then that isn't enough. I guess I'll put one on each side. I'm mad at a game. What made you mad? This is an early access game called Foundry, and it's like a procedurally generated survival game that I wanted to try out. Let's start this. Assembler. This is the, like, storage. And then these are the two things that we need after that to get, like, better power. So we're not burning the forest. But I had to put the things in there. So, like, long-term plan is... Like, these drones will mine this, then they come along here on the outside into these smelteries and then I will have these things pumping them out so then we'll have like a steady stream of manufactured goods from each side into some storage containers and then all of this will be automated 
And then when we can get automated power, then we won't have to worry about power either. We can just let these go. But I'm trying to set it up so it's like it's good enough for endgame, but I don't really know what the endgame looks like, but. I know where I got to in like my playthrough. My like little playthrough was the guy was like, you need more smelters, it's eight to max out a drone thing, so. I thought if I start off by making enough space, then we're like set up for the future, you know. We can take all this shit out. I'm a little wary of making more smelteries. Because I do feel <laughs> like we uh we're really straining the power that we have. So I'm just going to keep making science packs until we can get more power, I think. Yeah, but look at the fucking speed in which that fuel is going down. Wait, what game were you playing, Pizza? Got it. We now have the emergency beacon blueprint. Craft it and place it, but not too close to your existing machines. Those rescue parties tend to land right on top of the beacons. I will, soon, surely. Actually, how much is an assembler? Because that's the thing, oh, that's the thing we're going to get next, right? Because I could just let that go, I guess. No, I didn't see what game you were playing. I think we got kind of lucky that both of our four things were, like, parallel to each other. It would be even better if like the Ignium ore is that way. I actually think we might be able to see where all the ores are. There's an unknown resource behind us. Under here, I guess. So I guess we'll be going that way rather than that way. Which is a little bit annoying because that way is flatter. Rogue Company. Oh, I see. It did go through. So because it's a dead game, the only people that are playing get the people that are insanely good. That's my experience with most of the FromSoft games. That was my experience with Dark Souls 3 for sure. Is that everybody that was playing that game had already probably played through it a trillion times. Yeah, I feel it. Jesus Christ. Uh-oh. <laughs> Quick research. Research faster, please. I have a lot of shit now, though. I also, like, you can make multiple research servers, but you can only research one thing at a time. I don't know whether, like, having multiple and having them all be feeding into one thing makes it go quicker. Maybe. What a YouTube show I have to stream? Okay, sure. Okay, we have an assembler now. Let's make one of those. And then what is it to make these? Machinery parts and technum rods. Okay.
Okay, I'll look at it after the stream. How many do I need for this? I need five for this. Then I need 15. So I need another 35. Plus whatever it's used now, so probably... Like 40, I would say. We're like 35 to 40. And I have... Seventeen plus five, which is twenty-two. Make a random scam call. That's huge. Um, I need a lot more than I guess. I guess it might be better for me to stop working on those, for me to build an assembler and then just have the assembler do it. I guess. Oh boy. Assembler's real big. So, okay, so if that's that way. Just build a bunch of these. to make these and then let's just make a hundred of those just have those going in the background Oh, right, so I have two on the side, <laughs> I was gonna say. I was very confused as to why that was happening then. Okay, so now we need burner generator. Why can I not do burner generator from here? Oh, because I need to do this one first. Um, and then let's... Manage inventory. Let's put 200 of these in. Let's put 100 of these in. And then we just let them go, I think. Let's make another 100 of these. Okay. We're really gonna run out of fuel. <laughs> Holy. We're going so fucking quick through this... But I think we're doing well. I think we're doing the right thing. And we're definitely like set up infrastructure wise. For it to be good late game. I really, what I really want from this game, I think it would be cool if they made the world like maybe a bit more I don't know. Like, give me more adversary. Adversary, I guess. Adversity? That was the word I was looking for. Like, with Subnautica, I know it's probably not fair to, like, compare most survival games to Subnautica, but, like, yeah, there is an element of you find a thing and then it lets you go deeper and then you find more of something else and then that lets you go deeper and then you get so deep that you find, like, the lore. But there's also, like, a lot of shit that will kill you and fuck you up, and there's a lot of upgrades that you can make to, like, make it so that probably won't happen as much. And I feel like a lot of these games don't really have that. You know what I mean? Like, they don't really have the, like, adversity side of things, it's just, like, you build the thing and then once you build it, it's built. Like, imagine if, like, you had a procedurally generated game, and on, like, this planet, you could have, kind of like No Man's Sky, like, different 
enemies spawning, depending on what, like, your spawn is. And you can build, like, turrets and stuff, and you can have, like, all of this stuff to, like, make bullets and automate making bullets and stuff. Would be kind of cool. And since you're a robot, you can make, like, a chamber to make a different robot. So if your robot dies when you're out exploring, then you just, like, come and snap back into the other one. And you can have, like, caves with a bunch of stuff in it and stuff like that. I don't think you would have to add much. And my main problem is, like, once you've done all this, and you've got it set up, and it's doing its own thing, like, that's the end of the game. There's, like, no reason to be doing any of this other than the, like, satisfying... Building the shit, you know? Is this a solo game? It is, but it can be multiplayer. They do have multiplayer support for it. And yeah, this is really like, I mean, it's building it, but very slow. Um, I guess we're really wasting time here because I'm not building all the stuff I need to. So I need six more of these. And then two more. So I need eight of these. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Um, which means I need load as I have enough for. I'll need more of these. Um, and then I guess I'll figure out what I'm doing with the logistics container when we get to that point. I need more loaders, so I need 8, 16, double that for 32. So I can't make enough loaders yet. To do the output, but I can do the inputs. And then we get in there. Although this is really struggling with the power strain, I think, now. It does have smart power usage, so it will only use power when machines are being used. Or at least that's what I've been told. So I'm okay to put these down when they have nothing in them. smeltery. Last night I thought of something. Share your night thought with me. <laughs> nice, so I maxed out on smelteries now. And if my theory is correct, then we're stud on some ignium, probably. Probably like right here. Or at least I hope that's what it is. Because if it's like this over here, <laughs> that's going to be annoying to get. Something as impossible as trying to convince... I know Avengers Endgame, I do. I am familiar. struggling for power. Do I waste biomass burners on this? Ah, eh, fuck it, you kiss. Fucking cutting down this forest. Magic Left's all superheroes team gum, it's the protagonists from all Souls and Souls-like games. 
Okay, there's a lot of souls licks. Please. Ignium. Oh, we're over here. Wow, that's far away. Holy shit. Okay. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Okay, sure. Oh boy, I'm gonna need so much shit then now. Man, I wonder what we were built on them. That's probably home. There she is. The Igneum Extractor. So, oh boy, this is gonna be, this is gonna be tough. The dark lies of the fallen lords. I'm glad that you put lies of B in there. Okay, if we do this, is this gonna, yes, okay. this and then like this and then we'll do boop, boop, boop. and then we'll do um boop and boop and then boop 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 Wait, what was the hypothetical then now of that? <laughs> is this you telling me that you just come up with a cool name? I mean, it is a cool name. I'll give it that. Okay, but I need like... More of those. A lot more of those. <laughs> Did I make some? No. The fuck? Where did that go? Let's make a bunch of this. Oh yeah, there they are. What a boop. There's no way you haven't heard of Lies of P. That wasn't even on the cards.
Um, okay, so then we want to do this. Gonna have to chop down this stone. Cool name and a cool concept. I mean, it is. I think that was like a golden age of games where. How do I say this? There was a lot of uh, like sharing and I liked it. There was a lot of like crossover and I wish we could get back to that era of games because I think that was like one of the best best eras. Like, I want to watch Kratos fight Doomslay, you know? And I would love for, like, a crossover game. I think, like, Lies of P, I know you've never played it. I don't think you've played it. I think, don't think we've talked about it, but... They are setting up, like, a universe... And I think that has potential to be sick. They're like setting up, like at the end of Lies of P, they do like a... I don't want to say like a reveal, because it's not a reveal, but... They show... Um, Dorothy, or at least her shoes. And I think they're setting up, like, a Souls-like universe. But, like, all of the Souls-likes are just based on fairy tales. And I actually kind of like that a lot. And so I'm sure in that universe there's going to be a lot of, like, crossing the beams, you know? But I'm excited for that. A oh, rare fuel. Fuck it. Yeah, exactly. Injustice is a great example. As a great example. Um. Okay. So. Let's see, so we probably want, like... We have this, like, here. Like that. And then this here, like this. And then this, like this. This can be, like, linked on to... this. What am I doing? I can just do this. Because my, like, plan is long term that we're gonna have burners, like, coming off of this. Probably. But you also use, like, Ignium for stuff, so... I'm gonna, like, have it siphon off, like, this bit here, but then it's gonna come to the main storage bit. But what are you trying to do? Survive? <laughs> I don't know. So, I- I need more power. But the only way to get more power is to get a burner generator, and the only way to get a burner generator is to wait for this thing to make them. Or to research them. And it's going by very slow. And the burners will eventually use this ore over here. So I'm just trying to get that set up. And then my plan is, these guys will start mining this. So I should know why they don't have any power. Maybe I just don't have any to go around. But then, 
It'll eventually start mining all of this shit. And then the fuel will come down here. It will get siphoned off into some burner generators here so they can be used. Then whatever's not used is going to come over here and into some storage. Is my plan. I just don't really know how I'm going to set the storage up yet. The burner generators are really <laughs> struggling. They, like, desperately need some more power. I think this should be enough. Oh, maybe this is why? This, this isn't connected? That's connected. Oops, still not connected. Is this bit connected? No. Now it has power, there we go. So it's really struggling. But once these are charged, this will start mining this. Which will then start pushing it this way. In fact, I'm gonna start getting some fuel. <laughs> Actually, <laughs> before we do anything else. I don't want to cut down the trees because I like the environment, but it's the only way we're going to be able to do anything here. I should don't know what happens if I go in the water. It's like there's all this exploration in this game. But I don't really know the point of it. Like, is there a reason for me to go exploring? Do I need, like, sand for something, maybe, that I need to, like, go to, like, a thing for? I don't really understand why I would need that. Oh, boy. Come on! <laughs> Come on, Barna! I believe... Come on, 90%! <laughs> we have enough shit to build them, I just don't know how to yet. I guess I'll start unloading some of this. Holy shit, we have so much. My inventory's almost full. Oh, I don't really know how to best do the... Storage. And maybe it's best to have a wall of storage like along this way and then they feed into this and then have a wall of storage here and then they feed into that. But the problem is I'm then gonna have to feed out of storage into other things to automate other things and I don't really know how to set up for that. No more filling that biomass burner by hand. Oh my god, Carl. It's time to upgrade to the burner generator oh, yeah, and dig up Ignium ore for automated power production. Let's power up our future. Let's power up our future, Carl. Um, burner generators. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Let's also get rid of that so we're, like, not wasting all the fuel. Let's go... Let's get rid of these. Get a bunch of these. Get rid of these. Off of my hotbar. Man, I have a lot of shit. Oh my god, our first burner generator. Okay, so are these 3x3? Three three? Yes. Oh no, the 4x4, four four. okay. Um. Jesus Christ, okay. So let's do... Yeah then, I guess. Intake, okay.
Look at us go. Now we've actually got, like, power, which is nice. Now I have to stop fucking worrying about power. Okay, so my plan was to have four either side, which I think is probably looking like the case. I don't really know how to shift F. Bolt demolish lets you drag. Oh, here we go. Shift F. Shift F. Okay, and then this comes out by how many? By five. So one, two, three, four, five. And there. And let me do panel. There. And then there. And then there. And then there. And then we can alternate this. So we do... This. 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 Okay. So they should have... Yeah, look at this! And then whatever's not used gets brought this way. Nice. Okay. So now how is grid power doing now? Pretty good. Um, this is probably going to be the next thing that we want. So we can merge conveyor belts together. So I'll start doing that, I guess. And then let's start moving some shit around. God, I have so much crap. Look at all this in my inventory. <laughs> so much shit. Okay, let's finally finish doing this. So I need another six of these. One, two, three, four. Oops, I make 20, okay. Well, I'll need them eventually, I guess. I forgot right-click mix five. And then we do boop, 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 boop. And then... Do we need any more smelteries? No, I'm maxed out smelteries. Boop, boop, boop. Boop, 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 boop. Boop, boop. Doot, 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 doot. Doot. Doot, doot. Okay. Look at us go. I'm actually gonna make a... Actually, I guess we'll make, two, like, a bunch of these. Make ten of these. I really don't know how to set up for late game, though, is the problem. Like, I feel like what we've done is fine. I don't know about this. Being there. Oh, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I'm actually going to get rid of these for now. Because I don't really know if that's where I want them to be. So we eventually want like boop, 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 boop. 
and then boop 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 so we need one two three four plus 16 so we actually need another 20 of them <laughs> i have so many things up at once um 10 15 20 and then let's just make a bunch more of those get this off my screen Actually, you know what? Let me just get rid of these. Because it'll be way easier to do the conveyor belts first than to do these. Okay, so, how big are the... I keep pressing V to pull this little thing up. How big are these? Five by... two by two. Okay. So if we do it... yeah, that's fine. Still strained on power, that is actually kind of nuts. Okay. And now... Jesus Christ. And this really gets, uh... complicated, I guess. <laughs> the further down we go. Okay, so now, if I've done this right, I mean, we're out of power, which is a little bit of a bummer, but... This should be output... 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 And then these are all inputs. I can't believe we're out of power. What the fuck? After all this... Actually kind of insane. Unless grid sti- Oh, because this grid isn't connected, that's why. There we go. Yeah, so now all this is getting, like, shuffled out, and uh, then these will all get filled up with plates. I was gonna say, like, it's insane that that amount of burners isn't powering anything, but it wasn't connected this way. So now we just do the same on this side. So how many things do we have? Four, so eight. So I need another... One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three. Four. This was fine, this was always meant to be closed off anyway. And I planned it out to be exactly wide enough. So I sure hope it is. Um, let's just for now make a little 
everything here just to put our stuff on. So we need one of these. Boop, 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 boop. 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 Oh shit, I'm making way too many of these. <laughs> Whoops. I keep pressing right click instead of left click. Um, Let's just make a bunch of these for now. It's gonna take us fucking forever to set this up anyway. So did I do it on the... No, I missed a gap. Okay. So I did it like from here then. Need to weigh more of these two. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, two, three, four. So I need another sixteen of these. God, Almighty. I just walk it, you know? Let me know it works. And then once we've done this, we'll never have to think about doing any of these ever again. And it is kind of satisfying to watch the things go down the lane. That's all the output one's done. Let's pop an input one in here just so we can start getting some stuff into the storage containers. Yeah, and then look, look at them go up. 600 in that one, 600 in that one. I think this is pretty good. I'm not gonna lie. I'm like pretty happy with what we've done. I don't know what we've done. But like all of this is now completely automated. I can't really fucking see what's going on. Because there's no lights anywhere. <laughs> like look at this industry that we have. I wonder if it would be better for it to be pumped into a container and then pumped back out again. You know? Man. Hell yeah. So for now we have all this, but I guess we could have these being pumped into... This too? Hmm. Only problem is that, like, I, I think it it's cooler for it to be on the inside because then I can just pump stuff from the outside. Like, outside can be where stuff gets made and the inside can be where, like, all of the input is. I think makes more sense, but I just don't know how to get this iridium or whatever it is through the inside. <laughs> you didn't. <laughs> Get the plumber and do another. Wow, what a waste of money. <laughs> what absolute waste. Man, I don't know what... I don't know. I don't know what I'm supposed to be doing here.
I have spent... This is what I mean about these types of games, is that I've spent all this time doing this, and it looks cool. And it definitely does... something. But what that thing is, I have no idea. Oh, I guess I could pump this into here. And then this would go along here. Well, then it would go into these first ones. Is there a way I can lock these? Doesn't look like it, does it? I mean, I can lock them... But that just means nothing goes in them. Can I do a loader on the above? No. I wonder if there's, like, a loader that will only pick up certain things. Yeah, there is. We're so far down. They're so far down the tree. Hmm. I don't know how to get this in to where it needs to be. I don't know. I don't know what I'm doing. so many buttons at once. I don't know. I don't know what to do. <laughs> Truly. Like, what I've made works, but I don't know how to, like, set it up, you know? We did the research that we needed to do. Can we do science pack two or three yet? What do I need for that? I need to do a character improvement before I can do that. Um, I guess that probably does make sense. Mineral rock. I guess it makes sense to go down the middle, right? So we can get these. I'll send you the end. Why would you ever do that, though? Unless, like, uni was free. Which I don't know if it is over there. It was for a little bit over here. Man, I really don't know what to do now. Because if I want this to come inside, then... Maybe get it to go under and then up. But that's gonna get messy, surely. The, like, best thing that I could have done is to get the, like, the loader that sorts things, but it's so far down the list that I just don't see it happening. <laughs> like, I need... 
One. Is it past circuit board? Freight elevator, logistics container. Sales warehouse. I don't even actually see where it is. Maintenance drone, that's kind of cool. Energy cell, solar power. Transformer. Jetpack. Show all research, here we go. I know it exists because I just saw it like two seconds ago. Underground mining. Assembly lines. So the fact that I'm not seeing it down here, cargo ships. Freight elevator, freight elevator, mining efficiency. Conveyor, conveyor. Am I? It did exist, right? Yeah, here we go. Burner generator. So I would need science pack, then these. Then I would need science pack one. Or science pack three. And then I could build it. For now, maybe we just... Let's just put it into one of these for now. Just so well, like storing it at least, because I feel like that kind of makes sense. And then I guess we just like wait for research to be done. Go back the beacon, I guess. The thing is, like, I played this a little bit, right, and I, like, looked at this and I was like, oh, it, it probably makes sense to, like, automate the, like, these things, these, like, science packs, because then I could have them just, like, automatically feeding into these, and then, like, I wouldn't even have to do anything, I could just, like, set something researching, and then I could go and fucking do whatever I wanted to. But number one, there's nothing to do... Other than, like, make shit anyway. So, like, once you've automated that one thing, you're, like, there's nothing to do after that bit. And number two is that, like, I don't know whether I fucked up or something, but, like, the loaders will only take so many things. Like, for whatever reason, it must be, like, a machine thing, because, like, here they'll just endlessly put stuff into this, right? But for smelteries, you'll notice that, like, they will only put in, like, three. And that's why you need, like, so many smelteries. And, like, it's the same for this. So, when I had it, like, automated, it, what it really meant was that, like, I had a room behind these that, like, the conveyor, conveyor belt was just filled with science packs. And I would I'd still have to go in and, like, manually take them off the conveyor belt and put them manually in here. So, like, it doesn't really make any sense to automate it. The only thing that I would probably say is, like, to automate it and then put them into chests. And then, like, manually take the chests out and then put them in there, but... Even then, like, you just stand around waiting for the, the research to be done, you know? You know what I mean? And, like, this would be a great point where, like, if there was adversity in this game, like, some monsters or other things on the planet that were a detriment to, like, your own player, then it would, like, force you to, like, build a house. Because they had, like, furniture and stuff, but, like, why? If this is all the game is... 
but it would like f like push you to build a house and it would push you to like oh maybe i can make like some kind of weapon and then i can make automate bullets for the weapon and i can make turrets and stuff like that i think that would be kind of cool because right now like there's this whole like procedurally generated world with nothing in it pretty much and i'm sure you need like sand and stuff and you need to go and find a desert and Maybe that's the only way to make glass, and then glass is the only way to make, like, certain things, but I just feel like that's where these games are lacking, is that there's no... There's no, like, thing to fight against, you know? You're just, like, building a thing to make the game slightly easier. And it's satisfying to, like, put all that work into it and have it be done, and, like, I don't have to do anything now. Like, at the start of the game, I'd have to make these manually, but now they're just, like, all being done as I'm talking. But like, once you're done with this, then what? You're just waiting for the bar to tick up in the top right until you can eventually make that one thing. And I feel like it would be a better game if there was just like more stuff to do in between. More stuff to fight against. The uni was free, they already had a shit ton of money, so I guess they made the uni free. I mean... There was like a an infamous uni course in the UK where you could like they would teach you how to be a Jedi. There was like a Star Wars uni course. I'm pretty sure there was a Harry Potter one too. But again, I feel like that was very much at the time when uni was free here. <laughs> I don't really see people paying to take that uni course, unless they have insane money and insane time. It's only open for about a month. That is wild. It also, like, it probably is a detriment to your own <laughs> employability, too. It's like, usually when you take a uni course, like, no matter what it is, I mean, I guess it depends on the job, but, like, if you take a uni course, then it's usually, like, pretty good on your CV, but if you take a uni course that's nothing, how to do nothing is probably going to be a detriment to your employability. <laughs> it might be the only uni course that you shouldn't put on your CV. I guess maybe I could still automate it this way. Machinery parts, technum rods probably won't be that hard. <laughs> I guess also the thing that I didn't really realize about this game is that there's no reason to, like, automate making plates or rods into something else, because in the crafting menu, you just, like, automatically do it anyway. So you only really need, like, the base things. It's just wild. I, I don't really know, like... Maybe there's, like, more to this game than just not understanding, but... They used to have their official website, the Bloomer's not going to work for official jobs. Official jobs! <laughs> but unofficial jobs, it will work. If you're, like, a really laid-back employer, and they're like, hell yeah, you took that thing. Respect. That might work. Three hundred thousand people in a month is insane. I mean, I guess like the the fact that you can say that you went to uni, you just don't have to tell them what your diploma's in. Yeah, like, yeah, I went to uni for however long, like a month. Got a diploma that fast because I'm that smart. I 
I don't know if you've noticed by the fact that I've been doing parkour around these machines, but I am very stuck as to what to do. <laughs> I mean, I could automate the science packs again, but... I mean, that is end of stream anyway. New! I like the game, I just... I don't know, I feel like... I mean, I've heard that the problem with Satisfactory as well was kind of the same, where, like, you put all this effort into, like, making a factory to, like, do all of this stuff, but then at the end of the day, like, the stuff is for nothing, really. And I guess this is kind of the same, but I just feel like it would be so much better if there was, like, a reason to be doing it, you know? Maybe I'm, like, missing the point. And it is very satisfying, but I, I feel like it would be more rewarding if there was something that you were fighting against that you needed a thing for or whatever. Oh, that's kind of cool. Have a raid suggestion? Yeah, shout it out. Let me know. We will raid. And then I'll be back. Uh... Tomorrow? Yes. <laughs> Forgot what day we were on today. That's not Friday and Wednesday have been swapped around and then Wednesday was kind of messed up. So my days are all over the place. But I'll be back tomorrow with some content warning, I think, with people. In fact, while I'm waiting for the raid suggestion, I will DM to see. Oops, I'm in all caps. I will almost certainly forget tomorrow. Um, and a Rokus. I will message because he was here last week. Hypnos, Monaco, Melon, and Jack. A little message. And see what they come back with. Atomic Badger, okie dokie. Yeah, I love that too. I don't know if they brought it out on PS5 though, it might just be a PC thing. Oh, Elden Ring, hell yeah. Okay, for sure. I appreciate you sticking around and hanging around in chat. Thank you very much. Um, I will be back, as I say, tomorrow to play some content warning and stuff, and then Sunday will be uh, party games as usual. So then you'll get a chance to play with us. <laughs> But until then, I'll be back, as I say. I'm gonna go and eat some food and maybe go to the gym. Bass, we're to like end stream and then not have to do any editing work. This is big for me. I'm like all caught up. Actually, I have an upload to do. Never mind, to take it back. Is that a splinter? Where do you get a splinter from? I'm getting sidetracked. As to say, I'll be back tomorrow. <laughs> Thank you for sticking around and hanging around in shit. Goodbye. That always takes so long. <laughs>